JP Morgan out with a note today forecasting that the S&P could end the year at 4,800, about almost 28 percent higher than it closed yesterday, and basically saying that they see inflation moderating in the second half of the year, leading to that so-called soft landing. What do you what else do you think needs to happen? This is the note right here. We're showing it to you right now. What else do you think it needs to happen to kind of create this so-called soft landing and to avoid a recession and, and make stocks increasingly attractive in the second half? Well, I think we need to see that the economy hangs in there and the consumers need to keep spending, right, in order to, to facilitate ongoing economic growth because the consumer is such an important piece of that. And I think as long as the job market remains relatively healthy, even if some of the froth comes out of it, and inflation does come down and that alleviates some of the, the pressure that the consumer is feeling and causing them to have to dig into the savings that they saved up over the last couple of years, in that dynamic, I think that we could have uh, more of that soft landing scenario. But the consumer is such an important piece of our economy. And I think looking at where sentiment is today, it's incredibly low. No one's happy about paying higher prices. No one's happy about seeing the correction we've all experienced in financial markets. So I think, though, that um, as long as the consumer can remain healthy in spending um, and that we don't see a real significant uh, fall off in some of these areas, like the job market, that that, that would facilitate more of that soft landing that J.P. Morgan is is uh, is forecasting.